let's learn all conventional symbols so the first one you can see that these are in purple color so these are the expressway you know that pune mumbai expressway this is a bridge on a expressway and this is milestone now if it is a like single carriageway then it is like uh, in between these are metal road in between lines and if it is double carriageway, then they are parallel lined like this, okay? Now, if a place is having metal road, occupation should be then trading, okay? So, with maybe that area is having yellow color, so you can say agriculture, but if it is connected by metal road, um, occupation can be even trading. When that double line becomes broken, then this is on metal road this is a single thin road is our cut track that single thin road is broken so it is pack track single thin road is dotted that is your footpath now we are coming to streams that is the small uh, strip okay so here undefined means which gets dried and then this is canal there are some canal in your topo sheet okay then depths masonry or you can say this is masonry or rock built it's made by either braves or uh, that a mason has made it the other one is that is filled with artwork that may be pebbles and boulders and mud and rocks and soil and all this the weir this is to just to break the speed of a river so it is a kind of low wall over which water actually flows but it breaks the speed 3r that is called um, relative height of the bank of the river remember that if it is in black that is height if it is in blue it is depth okay and then submerged rock that's under the rock and shoal which is a small stream filled with rocks and then swamp swamp we know swamp and the reeds now next you look at this well so if it is complete blue solid color that is perennial lined well when it is on the outline perennial unlined well this is for tubal triangle blue triangle blue plus is spring and this is a tank which is perennial if it is having blue color if it is black that means it is not perennial embankment that means when uh, this mostly this pwd department they make the on the both side of the road they make it higher so that during rainy season that should be properly motorable that's called embankment and r already we know then this is a tank blue color that we can see that black r so that is the height of the embankment and this is broken ground broken ground happens where we have alternate wet and dry season let's go for the railway so this is when it is rs means railway station and these are different gauges just check and this is with milestone like same thing even you will find on the side of the road so that is for road this is for railway here is um this is clean where we uh, bake bricks this is cutting that means a small hill can be cut and tunnel should be made it through so that you can go either by road or by railways and these are contour line we know these are contour lines and they are showing different features like clip where all these contour lines are close together this is a small hillocks next is sand dunes these are different types of sand dunes now we are coming to villages if houses this is a compact settlement one we can see even that uh, metal road is here if there that is a small cross that means the place is deserted nobody is living there fort is symbol is this now this is permanent hut this is temporary hut so if the areas where there is transhumans that means people are moving with animals you will find this um, temporary hut tower maybe mobile tower 
okay antiquities that means a place which is having some connection historical connection okay that is antiquities now remember a temple is having a door when that symbol is not having a door that is our chhatri because chhatri is not having a door it is on four pillars then church and mosque and idga idga is for enduring eat people come and they greet each other here in idga and then tomb and graves lighthouse uh, this area is none of this symbol you'll find in topo because that's not a uh, it is it's in desert area mostly then we are coming to mines wine grass shrub is very common because if it is shrub open shrub and uh, grass these are because these are dry areas so you can find that palm and bamboo and other trees just you can look at that if our area is yellow the um, people are engaged in cultivation if it is green then people are engaged in forestry and remember black color tree is survey tree survey tree is a kind of spot height so this tree is having a certain height it shows the height of that particular place okay after these different types of boundaries so you can see here state so you know international boundary between two countries state demarcated undemarcated somewhere you will find that proper uh, fencing is there so that is demarcated if fencing is not there undemarcated this is district and the hassle smaller division of a district is the hassle okay and if that is with green color then it's the forest boundary so any boundary that is with this is if it is dark black color then it is surveyed if it is not then it is not surveyed or unlocated then we know this is triangulated height height measured with the help of trigonometry okay so that's triangulated height spot height this is a random point they take and um, so it's uh, to show the slope of the land so you need spot height suppose a river is flowing and arrow is not there but you want to know that which way the river is flowing so you can go for a spot height benchmark is bm and so benchmark is like it's another kind of sh it shows the height and all these heights are from uh, sea level okay and in meters so benchmark is is in a plate it is the height is written and maybe it is stick to a, a cemented ground or maybe a pillar then this is post office which is uh, mostly it looks like a uh, we used to drop a letter box those old letter box like that tank the blue one that is the overhead tank and it's the box with two standing line at the bottom rest house and uh, circuit house these are for officials who take rest when they are on official duty police station then camping ground for where people go and enjoy like as abu is part of this topo so there is camping ground is there reserve forest and protected forest and then we know hospital when it is red plus with a circle inside a circle that's a hospital then uh, if it is only red plus then it's a dispensary which is smaller than a hospital and then the last one is veterinary hospital it's for animals domestic animals then aerodrome and helipad and tourist site tourist site this abu is a tourist site so where people go to enjoy power line with pylons pylons means those big structures on which uh, wares are there electric wares these are for um, high voltage wire okay so that is pylon and if these are like if those are not um, colored black color just outline is there then it is unsurveyed that's it. Thank you.